So registration for the 54th annual Kandeska Extreme Canoe Race is underway. After taking a year off because of the pandemic, the race is back, but with a few precautionary changes this year. Bangor Parks and Rec Director Tracy Willette explains some of the changes ahead while we look back at some of the past events. Three, two, one, two. We had to cancel the race last season in 2020, but uh, this year, we're able to, with some some changes, some adjustments, we're able to offer the Kandeska Extreme Canoe Race for 2021. <laughs> We've had to reduce uh, the number of classes from typically 24 to 7. So we did that so that we can maintain uh, the current uh, parameters for gatherings out the start on Saturday morning. But there's still a lot of swimmers, and that's the part of the party is watching the swimmers. One of the biggest changes, in addition to the registration of the classes, is Six Mile Falls. Uh, we're not going to be able to allow spectators out there this year. Um, so there'll be no spectators there, uh, no spectators at the start. Uh, typically, folks will gather on the bridge. We're not going to be able to allow that this year. So essentially, it'll be a smaller race. But certainly, once folks get in the water, it's not going to look any different, feel any different. That water will still be very chilly in April, and it's still the same 16 and a half miles from the Desig Village to downtown Bangor, uh, like it always is. Very cool. Well, it says participants will also need to wear a face covering to and from their boat. For more information about the race, you can just head to our website.